You're watching ZPGNet, your source for personality-driven content. My name's JP Sirwolf, and it's time to play Amnesia, The Dark Descent. Are you ready for the voice of terror? Well, you better damn well hope so, because it's time to get right back into the action. Well, let's get right back into the action, shall we? Uh, if we have to, yes, let's continue. Previously saved game... Oh, God. Oh. Okay. Oh. Nope, nope, nope. Alright, so I guess we gotta go this way. Yep. Oh, God. Oh, God. sorts of fucking nope. Oh god, fucking nope, fucking no! No, 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 no! Fucking nope! Oh, nope, 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 nope! Oh, look. Great, okay, I found out what that switch controls. Alright. Alright. So far, so good. Yep. Oh god, fucking no, fucking no! Okay. <laughs> no, 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 no! Okay. Oh God, get up! <laughs> oh God! Why, gods, why? Crap, 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 crap! Oh, sport nuggets! <laughs> okay. Like, the tension wasn't high enough, you gotta have this guy running after me like some sort of freakish Frankenstein! Okay. Sorry. Sorry. Come on! What was that? What was that? Come on! Aw, oh, man! Ugh. Freaking me out enough, dude! Mm. Oh, pork nuggets. this now. <laughs> Good luck! Nope! Yeah. Nope! Ha! <laughs> oh god, there's two of them. Ah. Uh. Pork gobble. And my lantern's all mouthed out. Ugh. Hey, some lantern oil. Mmm, thank you. Needed that. Oh, but I have an idea. 
Yep. I have an idea. Oh! Hey, no, no. Bad horrifying monster from beyond! No! No. You are a bad monstrosity. Very bad. Okay. All right. Small problem. Now the other box is too far away. And I guess we're just gonna have to make a break for it. Ow, what the hell? Come on, really again? Oh, dead flesh can act as a distract. Really, really, really? I can throw body parts? to me. Brought it right to me. Jump up on the box. Jump on the other box. Go get a hand. Do, 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 do. Hey, buddy. Hi. Hey there. Hey. Hi. Yeah. Could you just wait? Oh, God. Go for the arm! Go for the arm! Large brushed against his leg and he felt himself being dragged along by the current of the beast. He pushed himself above the surface. Help! He cried as the ocean swallowed him again. Oh, God, this is getting weird. Oh, God, there's more water. Why is there water? Oh, no, no, not water, 
please, no, not water, please, no, not water. Oh, I think I need to go faster, must go faster, must go faster. Phew! Oh, hi! Oh! Hey! Whoa, 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 whoa! Let's go faster! Oh! No, 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 no! Ho, 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 ho. Block the path! Run! Really? You don't say! You don't say! My sanity meter's going down. Nope. Oh, I can hear it hitting doors. Ah, crap, 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 close! Oh god. Oh crap, 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 crap! Woo, I can hear it coming! Oh god! He felt himself being hoisted out of the ocean! The lacquered hull of SSO Artensia glistened in the zooming warm yellow light of a setting sun! He turned his head to the calm ocean, reaching towards the coast of Portugal and thought, is this? Another dream. Yeah, bitch! We made it! <laughs> oh shit, this looks terrifying. Okay. Oh look, the, the blood. Alright, well what's what's going on here? Hi. Oh god, it's hideous. Okay. Okay. Okay, we made it to somewhere. Blood came from what I can only assume to be this direction. Oh god. You have an ascending room. Will it take us to the inner sanctum? It will definitely take care of the vertical part of our journey. So, you have ridden an elevator before? Yes, the Colosseum of Regent's Park has one. It takes you to the gallery where you can view the panorama. Good. This ride might be a little longer. And in the other direction. Oh god, it goes down. That cannot be good. Alright, well... I'm just gonna close that. Get this little... Oh, of course not. Okay. Start the engine that powers the elevator. Alright. Alright, I'd like to apologize for my earlier outburst. Because I was clearly completely insane. And I'd like to say it probably won't happen again. It's a machine room. It's locked. Okay. Alright, he unlocks the door to the machine room. Alright, I think that should have been obvious, but I am a genius and I need to check. Uh, I would just like to say that this game is terrifying in every respect. Every respect. And that I am very much awed by the creators of this game. Because holy crap. I have almost pissed myself, and I haven't even seen a monster. 
study. All right, let's try the study. Herbert's trunk was wrapped in rope. The lock had been broken by thieves, he assumed. He wondered if anything had been left considering all the hands it had passed. I don't know. You know, my neighbor's probably just a, uh, a bore me. It's the opposite of a door, it's a bore. And it means, holy crap, we can't shoot. Ugh, my cut hurts. Okay. I got cut at work a while ago. Hey, tinderbox. That's helpful. That's helpful. Hey, I know you. You're Pewdie's friend. Huh? There you go. All right, let's see. Anything good in here? Not so much. All right, let's get going. Really, no need to light every. Hey, a tinderbox. I don't know how I missed that last time. Well, it's just, uh... Hello? Anybody home? Hi. Yeah, I was looking for a key. Any key. Any key at all. Um, you know, just rifling through your house and all. Oh, well, that was weird. Ah, here we go. Letter regarding the discovery of an orb. To my most trusted student and friend, Johann Weyer. The most remarkable thing happened as I was traveling through the Prussian woods this summer. I found leaf. Found I finally found one of the orbs I have been looking for for the last 20 odd years. It is as ex... Am I just not allowed to read today? Is that what it is? Is my face just that jacked up from work? Ahem. <clears throat> it is as inexplicable as the Heliodromus described it in the Hortus Conclusus. It was as well, let me just get right in there. There we go. It was as was told about an underground Mithratic temple crowned with the unearthly artifact. The orb was big enough to fill my cupped hands, and the texture was smooth and jagged. The color washed while rich. Contrast is not enough to describe its nature. It was an impossibility. An artificial paradox captured within stone. I was staying in a nearby village called Aldstadt, investigating one of the antiquated trails when I finally found the cavern. I went inside, and suddenly I could verify the truth of these enigmatic artifacts. Artifacts! Artifacts! Okay, sorry. They were real. As you can understand, this is the most important discovery of my life but it has also become my greatest fear. As I entered the underground chamber, I could feel that I was trespassing. Because of my curiosity, I did my best to fight these instincts and fetch the orb from its place. I scrambled out of the chamber and into the woods. I could sense something was following me. It bayed loudly as it closed in. This beast. This guardian of the orb was relentless in its pursuit. I made my way to a nearby ravine where I stumbled upon some men fishing in the lake. I tried to warn them as I passed, but fortunately they remained as I continued my escape. When I heard their cry of pain echo through the valley, I felt such a tremendous sense of relief thinking I would be spared. 
Suddenly, a blue, shimmering light engulfed me, and the colors of the forest were washed away before my eyes. I kept running through bleak surroundings. The tree turned charcoal black with leaves of cinder, the ground covered in murky water. I pressed on through the drenched land as the growing, glowing ember gave way to the rising wind and rained on me. I could hear pleading screams in the distance, and I joined in as pain and fear overtook me. I fell to the ground, grasping for air. This certainly must sound strange, but I had been carried miles away across the Alps to a grassy field outside Genoa. The Guardian had taken the orb from me, but still until this day I fear its return. Sometimes I lay awake at night, listening for the howling cry I heard in the forest. It has been nearly a decade since that day, and I still haven't been able to write about the incident. The last time we spoke, you told me about your interest and ongoing research into the mythic orbs, and I realized I owed you a truth about my visit to Altstadt. Your friend and mentor, Heinrich Cornelius Agrippa. Ah, oh, dude, that's, that's some jacked up shit right there. <clears throat> Mike. Really jacked up shit. All right, well, I guess we're gonna have to go deeper. Somebody lit a candle? Okay, let's just stay near these candles. It always feels like we're going somewhere we should not to. Hello? Anyone home? No? Yes? Maybe? I don't know. Alright. Oh. This is pleasant. Really jacked up, but kind of pleasant. I mean... Milestones of human anatomy. Understanding balance. The canine jaw. Oh, it's anatomical studies. See, there he is. Oh, oh, a little grizzly. It's a chair. I don't want to go in there right now. <laughs> I don't want to. Why is? Uh... Oh, I see. Okay, it's just more anatomical study. Another bird. Let's see what you have to offer. <coughs> ah, what a mess. I should have sharpened the saw. But I can sense it. It's definitely there. to this rabbit thing. Oh my god. Canine spine. Oh, dude. This is beyond fucked up right here. Oh, wait, here, a note. Doink. Canis lupus familiaris. 1658, April the 12th. After a short study, it is clear that the agitation found among humans can be found in the dog. Fear and pain induce stress, which seems to trigger an androgenous response, causing the animal to burst with energy. I believe that the catalyst is produced in the brain. It is difficult to determine exactly where and what it is, but I can sense it. It reeks of cosmic genesis. There is an inherent problem in harvesting this energy, since the creature is bound to die from the exercise. I must refine this process of torture to enable any real work to be done. More experiments must be performed. But it seems that only human beings are able to produce the amount necessary. 
It might be their ability to appreciate the severity of the process that ultimately augments their experience of terror. Oh my god. Alright. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I think that's about all I can handle there. And that means we're going to go ahead and wrap it up right there. Holy crap. Oh, God. Okay. All right. All right. All right. That's really goddamn creepy shit, dude. Oh, my God. I know. I know. I'm not supposed to be cursing. I don't care. I don't care. Um... <laughs> Keep it tuned here to ZPGNet, your source for personality-driven content. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more. You've been watching me play Amnesia and probably losing my mind and probably having a heart attack right now, to be honest, because everything's kind of tight in the old chest area. I hope you enjoyed today's episode as much as I did. I'll see you next time. Bye now!